collaboration between nutritionists and chef have to be very close because you know nutritionists calculate carbs what the rider is supposed to eat during the day and of course during the race and I am the dead one who prepared that carbs and of course the other the other food important is to know the habits of the riders because of that me and my nutritionists have to preparing the menu so at the end two of us have to collaborate on the race before the race and of course after the race to to see the review of the race during the day they have to to eat some uh, quantity of uh, carbs. Uh, our nutritionists calculate everything, so they for breakfast, uh, for example, from carbs have bread, porridge, uh, pasta, rice. Uh, nutritionists calculate and say to each rider separately how much he need to eat. It's important word need, because sometimes it's a big quantity, but riders have to eat to of course later have energy for the, for the racing. Every day we prepare recovery meals uh, for each rider by requires. Uh, meals I put in the bus and after the race, when they come to the bus, they take recovery meal for speedy recovery. Usually, again, normally it's always the carbs. Like you know, like in any sport, professional sport, the carbs are more important ingredient for giving an energy. Dinner is, is something different, of course, for first plate, again, carbs, again, can calculate quantity, but then they have second plate, fish or meat or uh, depend, uh, and then for dinner, a, a little bit uh, more enjoy. So I think the dinner is the, at the end of the race, most important meal for one rider. Each riders uh, uh, during uh, the uh, during the day has to know how many carbs has to eat and uh, also during race. For example, we we prepare uh, for uh, each stages a specific race plan. So when uh, uh, after dinner, I explain uh, to the riders uh, the next stage of the day and. Uh, for example, how many carbs he has to eat during, during each hour and uh, during the stage. Carbs uh, during breakfast and dinner. So for example, uh, we, we count also uh, the pancakes. So how many carbs are represented in pancakes or in porridge or in pasta. And they weight uh, each food that they eat. So in this way we can control their weight during all tour thanks to never second the, the products for uh, that uh, never second give us for example c90 that contains 90 grams per hour helps a lot to the riders during uh, hard, very hard stages only one gels more you can achieve in one hour 120 grams per hour instead to eat uh, uh, for ice cakes uh, or for uh, energy bars so this really helps a lot uh, our, our riders to perform well uh, and win uh, in some stages.